What's going on, everybody? I am the Bed Deck, and you are the internet. Welcome back to another video. Today, we have the Blue Beetle official trailer. One of the movies of the year that I'm most excited to see is the Blue Beetle movie. Blue Beetle has always been one of those favorites of mine that I've kind of grown up with, with the Young Justice and everything like that, and Justice 2. Just all around, Blue Beetle has been a super big player in the at least the most recent years uh, for me, and I'm super excited for this movie to come out. Uh, one of the, I think, the first Hispanic hero that's uh, in live action. Um, coming to a, a theater near you, really. Uh, the only other theater, like theatric release of a film featuring a Hispanic hero would be across uh, into the Spider Verse and, and soon to be in, uh, across the Spider Verse with both um, Miguel O'Hara and um, Miles Morales. So let's kind of get into the Blue Beetle um, trailer. I'm super excited for this. Uh, the suit from a while back looked really good, and I'm super excited to really dive deep into this. Excuse me, Mr. Reyes. You finished scraping the gum off that lounger or what? Uh, <laughs> everything right now feels so out of reach. You always land I on love your the feet, bro. Your hymen. We're going to Ted Accord. I don't know which is like uh, Ted Accord. There's a blue beetle. Jenny. Guard, I have got no life. But do not open it. You went in to get a shop. Big belly burger. A hamburger. Okay, I don't think it's George a Lopez with a gnarly goatee. What the hell is that? Oh, that scarab looks dope. Do that. I think he likes me. <laughs> That's some body whore type shit. That's gonna be great. That's fucking dope, dude. Fuck yes, that looks great. Okay, it's gonna be okay. <laughs> Dude, that suit in the CG looks really fucking good. What is going on? This is dope, dude. It's called the Scarab. It's some kind of world destroying weapon. It's just designed saving. to protect its host. The same that you want. Sometimes it does what you want, <laughs> and sometimes it doesn't. I, I, I think I cut a bus in half. <laughs> the Scarab chose you, but it belongs to me. Oh, is that is this going to be? Is that going to be your family? Makes you weak. I just wanna rock. The universe has sent you a gift, and you have to figure out what you're gonna do with it. Whatever you can imagine, I can create. That's fucking dope. Let's party. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! It's like Batman stuff. Batman's a fascist. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that looks like a ton of fun. I'm super excited for that. It looks like it's gonna mix like a lot of like uh, Spider Homecoming type things into it because I mean Blue Beetle is a very young character. Like, like yeah, I said, he's in Young Justice. And I think he had a Teen Titans run for a while. Um, but holy fuck, that looks like it's gonna be a fun ass time just with everything around it with the uh scorny weaver i know there's gonna be a lot of uh um hispanic aspects to it especially with the i think i think they said like around 30 percent of the film is in spanish just normally they have subtitles for people who don't speak spanish like myself but i i think that blue beetle might be the best film in, that dc's released in a few years um aside for the batman i think the batman might be the only thing that could probably be this of course the movie hasn't come out yet but i think that uh Blue Beetle is setting itself up to become one of the most successful DC properties that have been incorporated recently. I think that um, James Gunn um, starting off, basically, this is going to be the Iron Man of the new DCU, and I think that's a terrific idea, especially with such a young character, such a, uh, a breath of fresh new air. I think that it's, it's um, important that we get a lot more new blood. I'm retired of seeing just the Batmans and the Supermans. They're all well and great, and I think that we all love Batman and Superman as much as the next person, but I think that having new characters influence 
new ideas into the universe is super important. I think that DC is such a wealth of new characters and new ideas that we haven't really gotten brought to screen, like the Swamp Thing, and we haven't seen a proper Cap uh, Mr. Freeze, not Captain Freeze. Um, we just haven't seen a lot of proper DC uh, amalgamation, and I think that uh, James Gunn and the rest of DC is looking at Blue Beetle as, hey, this is a nice thing. Let's see how much getting our small characters involved. Let's see how well this does. And it's probably on a small budget already. So as long as it made some money, it's going to make a lot of money in terms of uh, our uh, risk of investment. So um, I think that Blue Beetle is the proper direction. And this trailer definitely sells me on this movie. I'm going to be there week one because of how fucking great this trailer is just sold me on this film and i think that's what a lot of trailers haven't been able to do lately is that they don't sell you in the film that's what the trailer's supposed to do they're supposed to sell you an idea in the film and give you a little bit of a taste of what's coming i think that a blue beetle is doing that phenomenally i think that um a lot of films haven't been able to do that especially in the franchise field lately so uh, that's me all for me that for this video thank you guys for watching i am the bad duck and you are the internet have a very good night i will see you guys in the next video